Hi, it's Tom Vitek with EXP Realty. I read some news on Financial uh, Post about the uh, changes uh, for the uh, mortgages uh, for the market over $1 million. So it says it's a boost for the 1 million to 1.5 million home market. When the government announced its new policy, it forgot to clarify what the minimum down payment would be for default insured purchases over 1 million. They finally confirmed this week that the down payment requirement is 5% on the first 500,000 and 10% of the balance. That's just 125,000 on a one and a half million purchase. Far less than the 300,000 re uh, currently required. So you need to put less down payment to buy uh, a higher priced property. Moreover, it's rumored that default insurance premiums on homes over 1 million may stay at the same 4.2% assuming 30 year amortization and minimum down payment. Amortization can be increased to 30 years from the current 25 years. That's a premium of up to 57,000 plus provincial tax on a one and a half million property. While pricey, this cost is offset by the 50 plus basis point rate savings that insured borrowers can get and from the ability to get in the market quicker and free up capital for other investments. If home prices eventually resume their historical pace, buying one year later could cost a buyer over a 5% more. Tell me what do you think? This is a good thing for a million and above uh, real estate market or not? Thank you for watching. This is Tom. Please connect with me on the socials.